One of the best things a home buyer can hear is, we have clear to close. It's one of the biggest milestones in the mortgage lending process and means the underwriter has cleared the application to move forward to document signing and close of escrow. While this is a critical stage for the sale, this is not the final step in closing on a home. There are several things that can still affect the transfer of title. After the underwriter clears the file, the buyer will receive the closing disclosure. This is provided at least three days before the closing date and provides the final fees and costs. There shouldn't be any surprises in the document, but buyers and their agent should review to make sure everything looks correct. The closing date will also be finalized at this time, which can mean you close per the contracted date. If you receive the clear to close early, then you may be able to move up the date, or if it's not received soon enough, you could be looking at extending your closing date. Another step after clear to close is the final property walkthrough, where buyers and their agent will walk through the home and make sure that the condition is the same as it was at the time of offer. They will also check for any agreed upon repairs. Finally, many lenders perform one more credit check and job verification on the day of close. Any change can prevent the loan from closing. Typically, after a clear to close is issued, you can expect to close three to five days later. Understanding the steps to close will prevent misunderstandings and help buyers plan for their move accordingly.